And first here at 11, more than 100 shell casings found scattered at the scene of one of Portland's most recent shootings. Thanks for joining us. I'm Brittany Falkers in tonight for Laurel. Our Mike Benner checked in with neighbors, frightened over what could come next. A home security camera capturing the moment bullets fly through a Park Rose neighborhood. People who live there, so terrified, not one of them wanted to show their face on camera. Well, you feel like you're a sitting duck. You feel like they're going to come back. Are they going to come back and get us? Are they going to come back and finish it because now they know what they did? These ones? All three of these. This woman and her family woke up to the gunfire early Sunday morning. Their apartment near Northeast 95th and Prescott hit by dozens of bullets. Just look at all the damage. It just sounded like just it was never going to end. 15 seconds turned into what felt like an eternity. Goes straight through the gas tank. A man across the courtyard echoes that sentiment. His apartment wasn't hit, but his SUV was three times, along with several other vehicles. We're literally just regular people, and we have multiple cars showing up and trying to shoot at us. Like, what did we do? This man was not hurt nor any of his neighbors, which detectives are calling a miracle. That's because officers recovered more than 100 shell casings at the scene in different calibers. Whether it's the most we've had really is kind of beside the point. 100 plus, 50 plus, really any number is unacceptable. With more than three months to go in 2021, Portland has already seen more than 870 shootings. That number is just shy of the total number of shootings in 2020 and more than doubles what we saw in 2019. It is taking its toll and people uh, don't feel safe uh, playing in front of their own house, walking in their own neighborhoods. Nobody in this Park Rose neighborhood does, that's for sure. In fact, they'll tell you this latest spat of gun violence has them considering a move. We don't wanna be here anymore. I don't wanna live here anymore. I want out of here, I want gone. You don't think it's gonna happen to you until it does. In Northeast Portland, I'm Mike Benner for KGW News.